Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and it is Croctober. So for the month of October, I usually do Croctober meals and I've shared a lot of Croctober and Crockpot recipes and I'll have a playlist linked down below. But this month, what I thought would be fun, and so I asked my Facebook group and I ask in the community tab here on YouTube is for you to share with me your favorite crock pot recipes and then I would make them and I would taste them and I would let you know what we think. So I'm really excited for today's video. So I am very excited for today's video. Um, y'all know, y'all know is in the playlist below. One of my favorite crock pot meals is Mississippi pot roast. I love it. I love it. But one of you told me I should try Mississippi chicken and I've never tried that. So that's what I made today. So let me turn you around, take you back in time, show you how we made this Mississippi chicken. So for this recipe, you're gonna need about two pounds of chicken. I got um, the chicken breast because that's what I had. So I'm gonna be using about two pounds of chicken. You're also going to be needing some whole pepperoncinis, some ranch seasoning mix, some au jus gravy mix, and you'll also be needing a stick of butter. Okay, so I've just put my chicken breast into the crock pot. Now we're gonna be adding in the pepperoncinis. I just take the whole pepperoncinis and just kind of scatter them in there. You can put as many or as few as you like, depending on the level of heat that you like. I like it a lot. So I'm gonna add about six or seven. Next, we're gonna pour in our au jus gravy mix. Yummy. Now we're gonna add in our ranch seasoning mix. And then we're gonna put a stick of butter in there. We're gonna cover and we are going to cook on low for eight hours. Here we go after this has cooked all day. Oh my goodness, it smells so good. Oh my goodness. I mean, I'm gonna take, oh wow, look. Two forks and just start shredding this up and letting it cook just a little bit longer in those juices. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm so excited. I've never tried this, y'all. Oh wow. All right, so I'm gonna keep shredding this up and I'm gonna let this cook in the juices for about another 30 minutes or so. And then we will be ready to taste. Oh my goodness. Okay, so here is that Mississippi chicken. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. You could, you could serve this over rice. You could serve it over mashed potatoes. Me today, I'm going to be making these into sliders. So, I found these Pepperidge Farm Sweet Hawaiian Sliders. They were on sale, so I got those. So I have my oven preheating. I'm going to broil these under the broiler right quick. I have some parchment paper here. I had to crinkle it up because it kept rolling up on me. So I'm going to get some of my slider rolls onto my baking sheet. We're gonna get those buttered so we can toast those up in the oven. Right now, I'm only doing four slider buns um, because the rest of the family is gonna be coming in later to eat. So I'm gonna go ahead and get these buttered. I am using this, I can't believe it's not butter spray, just to save a little bit of calories. You can use whatever buttery spray you like. I'm going to butter like that. And then I'm actually going to flip this over, get some butter on this side. All right, and I'm going to stick this under the broiler just until it's toasty and brown. Look at that. Oh my goodness. So, here we go. We are going to taste the glorious Mississippi chicken on the slider buns. I think this is going to be 
life changing? <laughs> Probably not, but you know. Anyway, let's get the taste. Okay, so here we go. I'm first gonna try it without any of the pepperoncinis on it, just the slider. Mm-mm-mm. That is so good. That is so good. It has all the flavor that I love about Mississippi Pot Roast, but it's chicken. Mmm. And on a slider, oh my gosh. This is the best thing I've eaten in like two weeks. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. That is good. Right up there with Mississippi Pot Roast. It might be better. Now someone told me to add some of the cooked pepperoncinis like to slice it up and put that on. So I'm gonna try that. I don't know how hot it's gonna be. I don't know. Let's try. Mm. Mm. That is some goodness there, guys. 10, 10. Ten, ten. Mm -hmm. Make this. Make it. So, that was so good. Like, I can't even begin to tell you how good that is. Like, So good. Please make that recipe. I will have it linked down below. Super simple. Oh my gosh, so much flavor. Thank you for suggesting that I switch over and try out Mississippi chicken. Definitely gonna be making this again. Guys, if you haven't already, join my Facebook group. I'll have a link down in the description box where you can interact with me, interact with members, of our community and share wonderful ideas and recipes. Or if you don't even wanna do that, leave me a comment down below. Share your favorite crock pot recipes because during the month of October, that's what I'm making is your recipes, your ideas. That's what I did today and I am super happy that I did. It is delicious. Again, thank you so much. I love you guys. I love your support. I love cooking your ideas up and sharing them with you. And so I will see you in the next video. I wonder whose recipe I'm gonna cook up next. Bye guys, love you.